In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, the Father, the Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father, the Almighty. From there he shall come to judge the living and the dead. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The joyful mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary. The first mystery, the Annunciation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The second joyful mystery, the visitation. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The third joyful mystery, the Nativity. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The fourth joyful mystery, the presentation of the child Jesus in the temple. (laughs) 
Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. As it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The fifth joyful mystery, the finding of the child Jesus in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve, to thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy towards us, and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal salvation, grant, we beseech thee, that meditating on these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise. Through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. May the divine assistance remain always with us, and may the souls of the faithful departed, through the mercy of God, rest in peace. Amen. O Mary, conceived without sin. O most sacred heart of Jesus. Saint Comgall. Saint Magnese. Saint Joseph. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.
In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, the communion of the Holy Spirit, be with you all. Good morning, everyone. I hope you all had a good Easter Sunday. On this blessed Easter Monday morning, we come together to continue our celebration of the resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ. So let us begin our Holy Mass with gratitude and praise for the gift of new life that Easter brings. And today's Mass is specially offered to Terry Smith anniversary. May the soul interest in peace and also pray for his family members. Let us see God's forgiveness. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts, in my words, in what I have done, what I have failed to do, through my fall, through my fall, through my most grievous fall. Therefore, I ask, Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace to people of goodwill. We praise you, we bless you, we adore you, we glorify you. We give you thanks for your great glory. Lord God, heavenly King, O God, Almighty Father, Lord Jesus Christ, only begotten Son, Lord God, Lamb of God, Son of the Father, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. You take away the sins of the world, receive our prayer. You are seated at the right hand of the Father, have mercy on us. For you alone are the Holy One, you alone are the Lord, you alone are the Most High Jesus Christ, the Holy Spirit, the glory of God the Father. Amen. Let us pray. O God, who give constant increase to your church by new offspring, grant that your servant may hold fast in their lives to the sacrament they have received in faith. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, lives and reigns with you the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. A reading from the Acts of the Apostles. On the day of Pentecost, Peter stood up with the eleven and addressed the crowd in a loud voice. Men of Israel, listen to what I am going to say. Jesus the Nazarene was a man commended to you by God by the miracles and portents and signs that God worked through him when he was among you, as you all know. This man, who was put into your power by the deliberate intention and foreknowledge of God, you took and had crucified by men outside the law. You killed him, but God raised him to life, freeing him from the pangs of Hades for it was impossible for him to be held in its power since, as David says of him, I saw the Lord before me always, so for him at my right hand nothing can shake me. So my heart was glad, and my tongue cried out with joy. My body too will rest in the hope that you will not abandon my soul to Hades, nor allow your Holy One to experience corruption. You have made known the way of life to me, you will fill me with gladness through your presence. Brothers, no one can deny that the patriarch David himself is dead and buried. His tomb is still with us. But since he was a prophet and knew that God had sworn him an oath to make one of us, his descendants, succeed him on the throne, what he foresaw and spoke about was the resurrection of the Christ. He is the one who was not abandoned to Hades and whose body did not experience corruption. God raised this man, Jesus, to life, and all of us are witness to that. Now raised to the heights by God's right hand, he has received from the Father, the Holy Spirit, who was promised, and what you see and hear is the outpouring of that Spirit. The word of the Lord. 
response, Preserve me, Lord, I take refuge in you. Preserve me, God, I take refuge in you. I say to the Lord, You are my God. O Lord, it is you who are my portion and cup. It is you yourself who are my prize. Preserve me, Lord, I take refuge in you. I will bless the Lord who gives me counsel, who even at night directs my heart. I keep the Lord ever in my sight. Since he is at my right hand, I shall stand firm. Preserve me, Lord, I take refuge in you. And so my heart rejoices, my soul is glad. Even my body shall rest in safety. For you will not leave my soul among the dead, nor let your beloved know decay. Preserve me, Lord, I take refuge in you. You will show me the path of life, the fullness of joy in your presence. At your right hand, happiness forever. Preserve me, Lord, I take refuge in you. Please stand to greet the gospel. Hallelujah, hallelujah. This day was made by the Lord. We rejoice and are glad. Hallelujah. The Lord be with you. Reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Filled with hope and great joy, the women came quickly away from the tomb and ran to tell the disciples. And there, coming to meet them, was Jesus. Greetings, he said. And the women came up to him and, falling down before him, clasped his feet. Then Jesus said to them, Do not be afraid. Go and tell my brothers that they must leave for Galilee. They will see me there. While they were on their way, some of the guard went off into the city to the, tell the chief priest all that had happened. These held a meeting with the elders and, after some discussion, handed a considerable sum of money to the soldiers with these instructions. This is what you must say. His disciples came during the night and stole him away while we were asleep. And should the governor come to hear for this, we undertake to put things right with him ourselves and to see that you do not get into the trouble. The soldiers took the money and carried out their instructions. And to this day, that is the story among the Jews. The Gospel of the Lord. Dear friends, the mood of Easter is very well captured at the beginning of this morning Gospel reading. Filled with awe and great joy, the women came quickly away from the tomb and ran to tell the disciples. So Easter is a feast that fills us with the great wonder and joy because it tells us that God's love is stronger than human sin and the life God gives is more powerful than the death humans often inflict on each other. And Easter also tells us that we do not walk through life alone. As the risen Lord says to the women in today's gospel reading, go and tell my brothers that they must leave for Galilee. They will see me there. As the risen Lord went ahead of his disciples to Galilee, so he goes ahead of us to all the places that we journey to and find ourselves in. So this Easter week, however we rejoice what God has done, the story of Easter, of life's triumph over death, of love's triumph over evil.
Pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. Let us pray. Accept graciously, O Lord, we pray, the offerings of your peoples that renew by confession of your name and by baptism they may attain unending happiness through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. Amen. Lift up your hearts. Amen. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. Amen. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, at all times to acclaim you, O Lord, but above all to love you yet more gloriously, when Christ our Passover has been sacrificed. For he is the true Lamb, who has taken away the sins of the world. By dying he has destroyed our death, and by rising restored our life. Therefore overcome with paschal joy, every land, every people excels in your praise. And even the heavenly powers, with the angelic host, sing together the unending hymn of your glory, as they acclaim. Holy, 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 Heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith, we proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church, spread throughout the world, and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, Dallin, our bishop, and all the clergy. Remember your servant, Hurry, whom you are called from this world to yourself. Grant that you are united with your son in a dead like his, may also be one with him in his resurrection. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them in the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit be coerced to eternal life, and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ.
through him and with him and in him. O God, Almighty Father, the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to pray. Our Father, Deliver us, Lord, we pray from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope, the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus Christ, who said your apostles, peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will. Live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. How mercy you. Lamb of God, take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, take away the sins of the world. May the receiving of your body and blood, Lord Jesus, may the mercy should not be the way of healing them. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him days away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should have my word. Only say the word, my soul shall be healed. May the body of Christ keep me safe for eternal life. May the blood of Christ keep me safe for eternal life.
We stand for the final blessing. <clears throat> Let us pray. May the grace of this Paschal Sacrament bound in our minds, we pray, O Lord, and make those you have set on the way of eternal salvation worthy of your gifts through Christ our Lord. The Lord be with you. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Go in peace. Hallelujah. 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 Mom.